My name's Ruth Weinstein. I live in the Ozark Mountains of uh, North Central Arkansas, and my husband and I garden. I do many other things, one of which is writing poetry about a gardening life, and I'm going to read a few poems for you today. The Legendary Tomatoes of New Jersey. The legendary tomatoes of New Jersey linger on the taste buds of my childhood memories. Their tart, sweet juice dripping warmly down my chin and arms, right in my grandfather's garden. That South Jersey sand could really grow the best asparagus, sweet corn, and tomatoes that anyone had an appetite for in the springs and summers of my youth. True, they were not grown organically, it being the 40s and 50s when DDT was king. And I don't remember the varieties of tomatoes, those little plum ones that someone's Italian grandmother turned into rich gravy, and the big honking slicers we ate with charred, high-quality burgers and grilled corn. Green ones and cukes made it into the crock with dill and garlic from my grandfather's patch, and once they were fermented just right, went into jars in the old propane fridge. The grated black radishes were eaten by the brave with rye or pumpernickel and Aunt Lena's butter, sour cream, and cottage cheese. And my mother... And her friend, the two Sylvias, dark beauties with red lipstick and cigarettes, canning peaches and tomatoes in the other Sills' kitchen, later laughing in their orangey-red sundresses, two hot tomato young mamas, saviors of summer's bounty.